Hi, this is Kalia from Crafting on the Fly and today I'm going to show you how to make this icicle cowl. I'm using this nice uh, bulky yarn from Hobby Lobby and an 8mm crochet hook. I'm starting with foundation, so do one and two chains and then you go back into the first one. You pull up a loop, so you have two on the hook. Now yarn over, go through one, and then yarn over again and go through two. And that's uh, the foundation single crochet. So then you start just going into the two top loops there. You pull up a loop, you have two on the hook, and yarn over, go through one, yarn over again and go through both. And that's how the stitch works. That's the foundation single crochet and that makes it so that everything is more stretchy than if you do just a foundation chain. So you keep going with that nice um, stitch until you are at uh, 43 foundation single crochet. So that's where I am right now. And then you chain one. And then you yarn over and go into that first stitch and do a single a double crochet there. Then you skip. Do a single crochet and then a double crochet into the same stitch. And then again you skip one and do a single crochet here the next one and then a double crochet into that same stitch. So you keep um, skipping one and then going into the next one with a single crochet and a double crochet into that same stitch. And then all the way to the end. And then once you get to the end here, it's again a single crochet and a double crochet. At the last one, which is going to do a single crochet. And then chain one, turn around. You go into that same first one with a double crochet. Because you did the single crochet at the end. And then now, since you have the pattern, you really go into uh, in between those two stitches. So it's a single crochet and then a double crochet in between the previous stitches. So there again the single crochet and then the double crochet. So in between those clusters only. So you keep those two and then you keep going with that all the way to the end. Oops. And also you go up a total of nine, nine rows of that. So you have the single one and then nine rows and then you can add your toggle um, button to it. Just use some regular yarn and get it on tight. And since um, this pattern stitch has so many holes, you can really use any holes and that's it.